One Health is a collaborative approach to considering the health of people, animals, and the environment that we all share. So One Health is an integrated approach to studying health. It specifically considers animal, human, and environmental health as an integrated whole. So really it's a research perspective, but it's also honestly a perspective on how to look at the world. So One Health is important because um, it really is a way to, to study disease or to study health in a broader perspective. I'll give you the perfect example, and the perfect example is COVID-19 caused by SARS coronavirus 2. So it is an animal origin virus. So we don't know exactly how it jumped into humans. We don't know exactly how the animal origin virus got into the human population and started spreading. But we do know it's, it originated in animals, just like SARS coronavirus 1 did, just like HIV did, just like Ebola, like influenza viruses do. So we know there are all these animal origin viruses that jump into humans and cause very significant disease problems, pandemics, epidemics, huge human health consequences. One Health is unique in that it allows us to really think about the collaboration that humans have with animals and our environment. If we only consider one, the health of one aspect, we're missing out on the rest of this interconnected being that we have on this planet. And thinking about the health of animals and the environment is critical when we want to ensure our own welfare and health. So that's one major, one major research goal with One Health is the prevention of disease. We call it moving up the chain. So instead of starting with how do we treat this sick person in the hospital, how do we find out where the virus came from so that person never gets sick in the first place? So the key takeaway is it's an interdisciplinary approach. So these teams of scientists are there to bring all of their unique research perspectives together to really um, focus down on a problem and try to solve that problem. Another aspect of One Health that I think is really important for people to, to appreciate is it's looking at consequences of actions, looking downstream multiple steps. Another example I like to use in my class is um, there was an environmental mandate in Europe to use biodiesel as a way to reduce CO2 emissions. Diesel engines are more efficient and biodiesel is renewable. Unfortunately, a major feedstock of biodiesel was palm oil, which was grown in Borneo. So they were clearing jungle in Borneo to grow palm, which is a major orangutan habitat. So an environmental mandate in Europe related to engines had a direct effect on orangutans in Borneo. So One Health is mandated to consider all of these downstream consequences so we can prevent orangutan habitat destruction before it even happens.